People of Interest is recommended by the National Education Association. The NEA once gave an official recommendation to the Saturday morning cartoon Denver the Last Dinosaur. People of Interest is at the very least on par with Denver the Last Dinosaur. Many leading scientists and mathematicians have long believed that the possibility of time travel is a myth. However, not a few weeks ago, the scientific community was turned completely on its head as an actual time traveler has appeared in the year 1996. Bradley Lucas activated his time machine a full 17 years ago and instantaneously appeared here in 2013. Mr. Lucas has dropped by to talk about the science of time travel and give us his unique take on the modern world. Bradley Lucas, welcome. Hello. So, uh, greetings uh, from the world of tomorrow, I suppose. Yeah, the future. Woo. <laughs> It's a, a, bit, a bit different from what you're used to in 1996. It's the same. <laughs> really? Why do you say that? I mean, come on, man. It's, it's, it's like the cars are just like they look different. Ooh. Okay, you got me on the, the little communicators. Those are awesome. Those are awesome. But, I mean, besides that, what do you got? Uh, well, have you tried logging on the internet? The what now? <laughs> uh, if you, if you remember AOL at all. Yeah. Well, Everybody's on it. <laughs> well, <laughs> um, not anymore. <laughs> How can that be? How, it's the whole world. I mean, it's at your fingertips. You can get everything. <laughs> well, now you can just sort of open your web browser and go online. <laughs> It's the same. It's, it's, it's the same. I just went brand. Are you? Did my time machine work? Are you people fucking with me? Uh, <laughs> certainly not. Well, let's let's go back to the past then. Um, what what about 1996 made you want to leave? Have you heard the music? I mean, have you heard it? I mean, they're all wearing flannel. It's like just guitars. It's like and the solos suck. <laughs> I just want the hair bands back. Are they back? The hair, I mean, everything comes around, right? Did I not jump far enough in the future? Like, you know, like Kiss and Poison, Motley Crue, they, you know, they're, they're still touring, I believe, but, um, oh my God. Uh, really, we're sort of in, actually, in the 90s nostalgia period right now. So you must be feeling pretty at home right now. <laughs> I wanted to leave home. <laughs> well, what, what, why 2013? You know, honestly, I just closed my eyes. I wanted some people I knew to still be alive. Or, you know, except, you know, Billy. I thought, I thought Billy on my street, I thought, you know, he, you know, the heroin would have killed him by now, but... <laughs> I mean, he's a dick. But have you, uh, have you looked up any of your old friends and family? Well, I can't find a phone book or a payphone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, have, you, uh, have you considered, uh, well, I guess the internet. So, uh, you probably don't have Facebook yet. Well, I mean, my AOL ID doesn't work anymore, so. <laughs> well, um, have, you, have you asked, have you seen anyone? I mean, you, you must have run into someone. Well, you know. Mom, she she moved on. I mean, I, I guess like when I when I didn't come home for dinner in 1996, she just like woohoo and sold the house. So I don't know who's living there now, but I mean, I don't know how long she waited either because you know I forgot to put a backwards on my time machine. It's like you know one away. Speaking of which, it's you set your time machine. So you built your time machine. Very impressive. Well, thank you. Thank you. It's about time. Somebody gave me a little credit. I mean, I did a lot of things wrong, but here's the, the future. <laughs> it's, so, it's like you jumped the gun a bit, though, having just gone forward when you should have figured out backwards, too. Look, physics is really complicated, <laughs> and I was just glad that I got it working in one direction. I figured it's a time machine can make all the time I want kind of thing. <laughs> and then I can work out the backwards stuff. You know, I just thought it'd be a lot more awesome. And like, I wouldn't really be homesick for a while. Sure. So, uh, are you homesick? 
A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> what would you say you missed the most? Oh boy. Um, well, I guess I, I, I miss, I miss, you know, the toys. <laughs> the toys were the best in the 90s, definitely. Uh, for instance? Well, for instance, you know, like, the crap you got now, it's all like, 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 Japanese anime and like, what is that? I mean, come on, what happened to the good stuff? For instance. <laughs> you really put me on the spot. <laughs> Why don't we talk about like science and stuff? What do you give me all this culture crap for? Sorry, I just, you know. <laughs> I mean, booked you on the show. Um, <laughs> I thought you wanted to like, you know, Talk about how awesome I am, because time machine, but no, let's talk about my personal preferences of pop culture. <laughs> That'll be cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, certainly. What? How? What's the secret behind <laughs> Well, you know, here's what it all is. Mm -hmm. It's like tachyons are this particle that move <laughs> in time and space. Sure. Okay? <laughs> So you just like grab one of them and you hit your ride. It's like really. It's that and that. That's it. <laughs> Did you have like a tube or what is it? What does the time machine look like? Well, I mean, come on, if I tell you what it looks like, your whole audience is gonna like go run and find it. Like if it's like disguised <laughs> as like, you know, a DeLorean or like some kind of phone booth, you know, everyone's gonna be, you know, messing with it. Sure, sure. And then we're, I'm going to be stuck here. You know, I'd like the option to like, you know, check out 2050 and beyond. You know, maybe, maybe it won't suck then. Has <laughs> uh, anything grabbed your attention here in 2013? Uh, give you some hope for Spain. Oh yeah, I mean, you know, Apple really sucked back in 96. <laughs> yeah. Steve Jobs, they kicked him out and like, it's kind of cool now. Yeah. Yeah, but they, they killed him, so... <laughs> he, he just died. <laughs> oh, come on. You can't be that awesome and not, like, die young and have it be just, like, natural causes or cancer. Come on. Come on. It was the government. Uh, we, we still actually haven't found a cure for cancer. Oh, my God! This is not the future. This... What, what have you done? Sell me on this decade. This is horrible. Uh, Why should I stay? I mean, okay, okay. Good job on the black president. Down with that. That's cool. That is awesome. Good work. Thank what you. else? Um, uh, before that, we can. Wait, I'm that one asking the questions oh. here. Oh, sorry. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just a time traveler. I'm a man out of time, but don't inform me about anything. I'll find out on my own. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> well, there was the Iraq War, the Afghanistan War. Oh, we had one of those. <laughs> <laughs> did you have a government shutdown? Yeah, we did have one of those. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it, it might actually might actually be 1996. <laughs> Is, is is just it's all cycles. <laughs> that and that. <laughs> that, and that. <laughs> well, uh, Bradley, uh, final question before you go. Uh, what's next for you? Well, I think I think I'm just gonna go hit 2030. Maybe you guys will have like better flavors of ice cream, <laughs> some cooler toys. And like you get that whole internet thing figured out, and AOL will be back on top. <laughs> well, uh, if the show's still running, I hope you'll stop by. Oh, I should. <laughs> <laughs>